Hey, uh, what's going on out there, folks? Rooster here in Tennessee. Uh, what we're looking at today, as you can see, is a, a Texas Star 667 mobile amplifier. Uh, obviously, it's missing the uh, knob on it there. Everything works on it from the delay all the way over to the preamp. Everything functions. We'll show that here in a second. Uh, we're going to be testing it on 14.5 uh, volts today. Uh, what we're running into it is a, a Galaxy 44 a radio that I use here testing stuff sometimes. And uh, we'll show you how much this radio is doing before we uh, do the output of the uh, 667. 50 watt scale, and we are on peak. Hello radio one two three. Hello radio one two three. Hello radio one two three. 30 to 35 watts output. It's a, a single final radio, so nothing crazy there. Let's put our uh, thousand watt slug in. You can see that. Oh, thousand watt slug. And we'll go ahead and put it back on peak. Uh, come over here and turn our uh, 667 on and we'll go ahead and uh, zoom in here and see what it does. Can a little less than 100. Hello radio 123. Hello radio 123. Hello radio 123. Audio test 123. Doing right at 600 watts. Hello test 123. Zoom out. Hello radio, you can see the meter functions on it. Everything works. Hello radio one two three. Hello radio one two three. Audio test one two three. Audio delay. Hello, you can see it's a delay kicking in there. All the lights work on it. It's in uh, good shape. Let's see what it does average real quick. Turn our peak kit off and go over here to average and see what it does. Hello, radio one, two, three. Audio, radio. Hello, radio one, two, three. Audio. Just under 250 or so average. Not too bad. Uh, but that's it. Texas Star 667. Uh, this one is for sale. I'll make somebody a, a good deal on it there. And if you're interested in it, hit me up and let me know. Again, it's a, a Texas Star 667. All right, catch you guys out there, 73s.